Hey friends, lately I've been intrigued with these motion sensors available on the Android Play Store, and I purchased this pro version of Salient Eye. And what I've ascertained through extensive experimentation with this is that it's a light sensor, not an ultrasonic or barometric sensor like you see here in the HCSR04 ultrasonic sensor. And I've used this with Arduino in pitch blackness. I'll put a link in the description of the video of how to use this. It's really cool. It's a diaphragm ultrasonic sensor. It is not affected by sunlight at all. And I'm surprised that these aren't integrated or this technology isn't integrated into like a Samsung J3 like I have here. Now I've gone through the settings in this thing. I've turned on LED on light detection. I've tried it from uh, meet from very low right up through high settings. And this app works great as long as there's some amount of light in pitch blackness. Even if I have it on high setting, it is not going to detect um, and trigger the camera no matter what I do, which leads me to exploring the Android technology as far as this stuff. Now, from what I'm gleaning, not all devices are going to have the um, type pressure function. Um, this is in the Android developers uh, environment sensor um, functions. As far as this app goes, the um, salient, I, I believe it's um, going on type light, detecting variances in light in the frame versus type pressure and the sensor values associated with pressure would be, you get pretty mathematical here. This stuff looks like Isaac Newton uh, versus uh, force and mass equations, as well as it looks like there's a gravitational constant in the formula as well. Barometric pressure is measured in the uh, Android function we're just looking at in hectopascals or HPA. Without the sensor on board on the device, you know, obviously these functions are not um, applicable. They, they, they can't be applied to, to the device. Do you guys have any um, insight on this as far as salient eye or these other motion detectors? on Android or even iPhone, they work great under low light conditions or especially daylight, but I'm looking for the nighttime kind of application like I'd use with the ultra, true ultrasonic sensor. Are you an Android developer? Please post your comments below to lend some insight into this topic. I realize this is a very niche topic here today. However, I'm hoping to hear from some of you to lend some insight. It's a fascinating topic. Thank you.